um, we are back. So, um, this phone stopped me because of the storage. I don't have so much storage. What is going on? I don't really get it. Anyways, if you didn't see my last video of Kova's dog, then you better see it right now. So, um, I am just sharpening my pencil, my color pencil, to color it white. And some of you might ask if the if the paper is white and the dog is white, why would you color it white? The thing is that there is a difference because when I color it white, it looks whiter and it looks better. But if I don't color it, it looks like gray. Well, not really, but some artists do it, some don't. I do it. Finally, I got it sharpened. Um, look at this. So, um, I have white and black. So, and more crayons. So, comment down below which is more important to me. White or black. Do it before I say it now. So, actually, black is more important to me when I do art. When it comes to coloring art. I mean, black is important. It's not my favorite color. Who likes black? Well, <laughs> I don't. It's a dark color. I like red. My favorite color. But when it comes to coloring dogs, you want to you wanna see this black? Let me see if I can get the black. This isn't the only black. Look at this. You wonder why is it like this, right? I use it like almost in every single dog. Look at this. The, the black I usually and always use to color dogs is this little centimeter long crayon. Do you guys like doing it like with a tiny crayon? I don't mind if it's like coloring with a normal crayon even though it's smaller. So let's color the kuvas. Um, can you see it? Like that? Can you guys see it? I don't know if you can see it but... You might see my hand, obviously, but I don't know if you can see the dog. This dog is very pretty. But if you didn't see my last video that was about this, but remember my story stopped my video. So, um, then re comment, I mean, I would like you to please research what is going on with my dog, my two-year-old dog, not 20-year-old dog. She's, Roxy is not even old, so, like, research, tell me what's going on with her, like, yeah, because it is very hard to know what is going on because that scares me. Let me finish calling it, okay? Okay, um... You probably know that I didn't mention the part of making. I mentioned the part of coloring. So I was like, um, I'm going to finish coloring this cool wash and I'll show it to you. Because it would take, I would still be coloring it. But actually, I colored it, but made it. Oh, ah! I fell on the ground. Okay, here. It is done. Do you like it? If so, then like this video. Um, does this look cute? Comment down below if this looks cute. <gasps> Wait, whoa, whoa. Roxy took off half of her shirt. Let's put that back on. Bad Roxy, she was gonna bite me. She used to do that when she was a puppy. She would take off her shirts and dresses on her own. Can you believe a dog taking their stuff on their own, their clothes? Well, if you don't believe it, then Roxy, isn't this adorable? But um, I don't, I don't want my dog biting her. So let me tell her something quick. I said it in Spanish because my dog knows in Spanish. She's like, leave me alone. I'm sleeping. Anyway, um, like and subscribe to this video. Um, wait a second. Did I just say subscribe to this video? 
Why would you guys subscribe to this video? Do like it. Not do you click the like button, not subscribe. Well, subscribe to my channel and like this video.